Topping our news today at noon, the struggle to fund mandated school resource officers. Right now, Manatee County government is debating cutting funding for SROs or raising taxes to pay for them. ABC 7 Jess Dowdrick joins us live from the commission meeting in Bradenton with the latest this afternoon. Jess? Scott, when state lawmakers passed the Marjorie Stoneman Douglas Public Safety Act, part of that included mandating that every school in Florida have a school resource officer in it. While the state is providing some extra funding for that, it's not nearly enough. And now the sheriff's office, county government, and the school board are discussing how to pay for those extra officers. The Manatee County Sheriff's Office has hired an additional 34 deputies to ensure there's one deputy in every elementary, middle school, and two in every high school. According to Manatee County government, Government, that costs $5.6 million. Typically, the county and school district split that cost. That means they'd each pay $2.8 million. Last year, the county only paid $900,000. Now, county commissioners are saying they'd have to raise taxes in order to continue to pay their half of that 50-50 split for SROs. So we all have to look at this fiscally. I'm all for supporting you guys. We have not raised our millage since 2009. Um, and not many counties can I think say that in Florida. We've got to look at, it, at this where we can help you and we can still help us and us be solvent. Manatee County Commissioners were not ready to make a decision on funding yet today. They're waiting for some numbers from the school district, the district and the county commissioners plan to meet again on May 8th. Reporting live in Manatee County, Just Aldrich, ABC 7, your Suncoast News.